Ni hao, I'm Avi from India. Namaste, I'm Sandy from China. And we have a YouTube channel Avi and Sandy, which you are watching, which got hacked. So in this video, we will tell you how our channel was hacked and how we got back from it and how you can avoid getting hacked also. Let's get started. What happened? Well, boy, it, uh, just thinking about it makes me nervous, you know, my heart is going up. <laughs> thinking, just thinking about that moment. So we were sitting in a restaurant. And in the restaurant, I got a notification on my phone. My phone, pe, uh, my Gmail and YouTube all account. There was a notification aaya that somebody has changed your recovery, pass, recovery phone number. And it was a new phone number. So I was like, shit. Somebody has changed my recovery phone number. Let's quickly do something about it. So on the prompt, I had a message that do something. Then I started doing it and changing my password. And I think I, I entered my password and then I started entering new password. And just at that moment, I got locked out from all my accounts in my phone. So I got message that you have been locked out from your uh, YouTube studio, from YouTube, from Gmail. Everything was then I locked out and I was like shit and uh, she was still eating. I haven't told her anything yet and uh, or, then yeah uh, at the very end of the course mm, I was still eating. Yeah. So I was sitting and I said I had to go to the because I needed my laptop and my PC to have access and see maybe something is wrong and I need to do something. I was told that I have been hacked at that time because I didn't change anything, I didn't change phone, I didn't log out anyone, and I log out with my side device, so I knew that I was hacked and I had to go to home fast. So I stood up and I started running. And I think um, you, I left you there, and, in, and right then the waiter came in saying, hey, it's a bill. <laughs> <laughs> like, they think uh, he is running away. Yeah, they are all oh, they, they have a fight or something and they are running. So I said, no, no, she will pay the bill. I'm going. And then I left and I ran and quickly reached home. And uh, yeah, I I saw my home PC laptop. I also locked out. Everything was locked out. And then I was like, oh shit, I got hacked. I was like, you know, I was not with me. I was listening to that on YouTube. But I was listening to all Two-factor authentication, all security, special codes from YouTube, all activated. And I even worked in I work in IT. I am a uh, IT project uh, program manager, so I know these things. So I feel like it can't happen to me. And I never go to any wrong website. If there is a link that is bad, I don't click on it. So I feel like it can happen to me. So I was like shocked. So I started going through YouTube videos. To see, okay, now what to do? Because I was hacked, I was not YouTube to contact anyone. So I, go, I started searching on YouTube, ki what to do, what can I do next, and etc. Et and to make things worse. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> right at the moment I was paying the bill, I just realized that my tongue has swollen up. Like that, I can <laughs> like this. <laughs> <laughs> and I <laughs> and I suddenly realized it might be something that I ate because mm -hmm. I ordered a quite a uh, exotic, exotic food, new food, exotic food, yeah. which is snails. <laughs> snails. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the first time in my life that mm -hmm. I had snail. I had it some years ago in France, but it, it must be a very long time. So mm -hmm. my body doesn't recognize this food anymore. It's a French dish, actually. Yeah, we were in a kind of a fancy restaurant <laughs> and having a nice date kind of with yeah yeah and so I panicked a bit because he was not there uh, and uh, yeah so when I was panicking I also I didn't tell you this I mm. also felt my throat also it's a bit hard to to ah, breathe breathe okay because it's uh, also sore there oh shit oh so I quickly uh, paid and then I ran to the closest pharmacy mm. and when I talked to them I, <laughs> yeah, I was wearing a mask and behind the oh, mask, mask I was, yeah. so they could not understand I had to read loud uh. I said I'm full allergy <laughs> food allergy <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh. Uh. But, uh, I think it was a long time ago because I thought that I would pay for the bill because it's a big thing I had to run away 
I was like, where is Sandy? Going through the YouTube video, I realized she has not come back home yet. I was like, what's going Took on? Me yeah. one hour. I, I thought she did. maybe she went for a walk or something. I was like, walk? Like, why did she go to walk? Oh yeah, it was in the evening. It was dark already. Yeah, my evening. My, our YouTube account is hacked. Yeah, she walk, she went to shopping. What shopping? I thought I thought you were shopping or something. It was nice. Okay. <laughs> yeah, then I called her and then she was back and she explained to me all this. Mm. I was like, oh shit, that's more important that your health is correct. The channel we can get back anytime, but you were fine and, and then... Yeah, luckily uh, it was just a mild allergy yeah, symptom yeah. and it happened right away after I had the food. So mm. I, I knew it was that mm. and I took the pill and it was, it got fine. Yeah. Then how I got the channel back, yeah, so... I have YouTube videos and they told me that the Twitter channel is YouTube, uh, YouTube team. Ka. Twitter will contact them and then they will send you how you can get the channel back because there was no way I can contact them without logging into my account even though I am YouTube partner but to contact through YouTube partner channel I have to be logged in logged into my account if I'm locked out and there's no way that some random person can contact them so I contacted them through Twitter they were very responsive more or less yeah they responded that okay they asked me more details, etc, etc. Mm -hmm. And then they said, okay, we will be working on it. In the meantime, uh, our channel got rebranded. I was like, oh shit, because I can see on my channel. You know, I can go as in YouTube and as a guest and see Car Cartona News. He changed the name and logo and banners and everything was changed for the hacker. And uh, also, they were then running some live streams, selling their cryptocurrency. I'm like, I'm like, oh shit! <laughs> but at that time, our old videos were still there. Yeah, old videos were there. He didn't delete any videos, but he was doing this live stream, and uh, I started receiving messages on Instagram through different channels that, hey, your channel has been hacked. Thank you very much for all those messages and your support. Really. Uh, I didn't realize, I didn't think that so many of you will send support messages and that kept me going and I was like okay well what can you do here and I sent to YouTube I followed their processes I filled up their form account recovery form mm -hmm. then they say okay wait until tomorrow and then they say okay we'll wait until tomorrow Le like in whole night that hacker was running live stream after live stream <laughs> Uh, I think he was running a live stream run kari, selling his crypto. I was thinking about going there and uh, curse him you know, on the live stream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, it's a half or two years of work. It's all the same. Because algorithms are affected by this. And if, if people are unsubscribing from your channel, then you know it's algorithm is affecting everything. So YouTube team has sent me a lot of mail and uh, they were asking about details. I provided all of that. And then they basically uh, put all my videos on unlisted so that means there was no videos visible to anybody on the channel I think it was like after one day and nobody can access the channel so they were like okay we need to restore your access to your to your Google account first and then we can work on your YouTube account then I got access to my Google account by filling more forms and I got access then also to my YouTube account and I changed all the videos to uh, public Mm -hmm. And I thought, okay, now it's done, now it's done. And I added Instagram stories that, okay, I got my channel back, Instagram great, everything great. And after two or three hours, the channel got deleted by YouTube. <laughs> I was like, what? How the hell can can get deleted? Because there were copyright strikes due to the live stream that ran by that hacker. And I think it's automatic algorithm that uh, branded the channel as doing something wrong, really wrong. So they say your channel has violated our policy and thus we are deleting the channel and nobody can have access to it. We have permanently removed you from YouTube. These are our terms, we can do it and you are gone. And I was like, all right, yeah. I was like, very happy, I got it back finally. And then this algorithm ran and everything got deleted. So I wrote to the YouTube again, then they said, no, don't worry. Again, good communication by the YouTube team. They were like, don't worry, we are working on it. They asked me more questions about YouTube or some IP addresses, etc. And they say, okay, tomorrow we will, um, you know, restore your videos and your channel. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, I think after two, after three days, finally, then the channel was restored. 
my access was restored, I cha changed all my passwords. It was a crazy experience. Uh, I think uh, the biggest fear that I have is my personal information that hacker has access to and what he can do with it. Mm. I was pretty confident that I will get the channel back eventually because of course, um, you know, it's my channel, but I was more afraid about the other things. So I was also changing my bank accounts and checking my financial data, what's happening there, etc., etc. But thankfully nothing wrong happened there. The, chat, the hacker is just, I think, interested in this live stream that he does for his cryptocurrency. Hackerji, please <laughs> find another way of selling your cryptocurrency. Don't hack people's YouTube channels. It's like you can go just away like that. And, uh, but thanks to YouTube team, it, it helped me. Now, uh, how I got hacked, you know, how and how you can avoid it. I think that's uh, important. I have, so I have some theories about it, I'm not sure because you know you can never be sure how you got hacked of course if i knew it at that time then i would have done something about it but i have some theories about it i think the first theory is because we were outside and i was using some uh, networks open networks different networks uh, during the day and i used in that to sign in through wi-fi i think i used some unsecure network and maybe through that they got my data mm -hmm. and that's how i got hacked because we were outside and using different networks, etc. So that's, I think, my one first theory. And the second theory is, you know, when you run a YouTube channel, you get a lot of sponsor emails that, hey, this, that, and you click on them, you see, okay, what's the website they are doing? What's the material they are selling? Uh, or is it, is it worthwhile to do, etc. So you do some research and click on those links. Maybe they got my information through those links that I have clicked. Mm. So I think a lesson learned for me is it's very, it's quite unavoidable to uh, to really make everything secure. Um, the key is to really separate your YouTube with your personal uh, emails. So what, uh, so my, what, I, what I've done now is you really separated my YouTube with my personal emails. So even if I get hacked, only YouTube is impacting and not my Gmail, not my email accounts, personal email accounts are impacted. So that's the first lesson that I'm going to take from it. And of course, the second lesson is don't get panicked. <laughs> of course, easy to say, but, uh, but yeah, I think at that moment I was like, uh, I think for one hour I was panicked, but then I see, and when I see a resolution, when the YouTube team said, okay, there is a way that we'll get you back, mm. then I was more relaxed that, okay, well, there is a resolution, there is a team who works on it, they know what to do, they've given me the form, etc. Then I was like, okay, ho jayega theek, mil jayega channel, I think. You know, I was more relaxed. All right, so this is the hacking craziness of one week. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, we survived through it. Channel is back. You are watching us again. We are with you again. And yeah. Uh, oh yeah, one more big announcement. There, will, there is a huge travel series coming up now. Uh, so we will be going to somewhere very special. Uh, first time in almost one and a half to two years. We are flying and going outside Germany. So we will be uploading a lot of new travel videos with a lot of new content and I'm very excited for that series, the travel series. The destination I will not tell you right now. Uh, you follow us on Instagram and wait for our videos on that. But it's going to be really awesome. I'm really excited to travel again after such a long time. Me too. Me too. Han Ji Chan. Okay guys then that's it for the video. Have a nice day. And Hacker Ji, please don't hack YouTube channels for your cryptocurrency. Huh? Please find some other way. <laughs> it's a lot of hard work. Please, please hackerji. Okay, ciao guys. Bye bye. Ciao. Bye.